To Theodore Rumpke won't be driving again anytime soon, but he also won't have to spend a lot of time behind bars. He was given less than two weeks in jail. Theodore Rumpke was convicted of negligent homicide after entering a no contest plea. The last time he went before Judge Dwayne Mallory, he was locked up for missing a pre sentencing meeting. That kept him behind bars for two weeks. Judge Mallory sentencing him today gave him 12 additional days. Last October, Rumpke lost control of his car on East Miami River Road, went off the road. Hit and killed Patricia Lutz and her daughter Jessica. Both died at the scene. The Lutz family had asked for the maximum sentence, saying Rumpke showed no remorse. Today, before sentencing, he delivered a tearful apology to the family. This is our last and The pain has gone through family. It hurts my heart so much, and I can imagine. Rumpke served a total of 15 days in jail before today's hearing. He also spent most of a year on house arrest. He'll serve an additional 12 days in lockup, two years on probation, and he won't be able to drive for five years. Live in the newsroom, Andrew Setters, WLWT News 5.